Hey guys, today we're going to be playing a bunch of abandoned Roblox games. For example, the game I'm in right now is The Guy's Place, which was created in 2006 and was left abandoned on the same day. Now, I'm not I'm not going to count The Guy's Place as an abandoned game for this video because I believe this is actually a 2006 starter place, but you get the idea. All of these games were last updated in the early 2010s at the latest, and I used this Twitter account called Happy Home underscore RBXL to find all these games. There's over a thousand tweets on this account, so you could uh, you could scroll down for a very long time and explore a bunch of different abandoned games. And our first game is the Roblox Hat Time Capsule, which was last updated in 2011. So as you can see, there is barely anything on the map. You know, we got we got some dirt particles, we got a shovel here, but the actual interesting part of the game is down this ladder because as you can see there's a bunch of hats just buried underground here. So what what's going on here is there used to be a feature where if you press the equals key it would just spill all your hats on the floor. So I think the the creator of this game just got a bunch of random people to just throw their hats into this box, probably using a build mode or whatever that feature was called. And now you you got all these random hats that people wore back in the day just preserved in here. Now I, I know what you're all thinking right now. Um, some of these hats have aged quite poorly. You know, it's it's very unfortunate, but but listen, it's an interesting look in the past, and we, we've got some Tetris hats in here, okay? I, that It's not all bad. This one is called Zombie Camp Attack. It's a very obscure one. It has 131 visits, no ratings, and it was made by Joe. Guys, we need to save Joe from the zombies. Here we go. Oh, there's the zombies. No, they're they're ki they killed Wolf. Oh no, and they they killed Zombie somehow, and now they're killing ah zombies. No, now they're going for help us. Don't worry, I have a gun. It doesn't. It's just throwing stuff on the floor. It's not doing anything. Look, they even killed school bus drivers. So now now we can't escape. Cause what just happened? Wait, that's that's me, but really short. I think that's my dead body right there. Guys, I think it's over for me. How do I- how do I activate the bomb? Oh, okay, that'll do it. This next game is called Failville. Welcome to Failville. There are currently 16 epic ways to fail here. See if you can find them all. And it was last updated in 2010. Let's see if we can find all the epic ways to fail. And I can't help but notice that I have a bomb in my inventory, so I guess we can use this to fail. There we go, that's one. Anything I can do on this playground area here? Maybe the slide will kill me? Apparently not. Bit suspicious of the sandbox. Oh. Oh, I'm sinking! Oh, I lost my legs! Oh, I'm dead. Well, that's, uh, that's two fails. Do not play in the catapult. Sorry, but I have to play in the catapult. Oh, jeez. I was not expecting that kind of power. What's going on, buddy? All right, that's four fails. Right next to the moose, there's a thing that says stand here, so I'm gonna stand here. Oh, what's in the vending machine? If I were to guess, I would say all of these items are probably poisoned, so I'm just, I'm gonna ingest all of them at once for maximum poisoning. There we go. What's going on in here? Apparently that moose over there is banned from this building. Oh, it's a, oh, okay. Let me just line this up. All right, yeah, that should do it. So that that wasn't even a way to fail. It just gave me a sniper rifle. But what's what's going on in this place? Oh, the door closed. Oh, photo booth. Instructions. Look here and wait for flash. Okay. Oh, we got a hot air balloon over here. Let me just get in that. It's um it's tipping a little bit. Oh jeez, it kicked me out. Oh no. Guys, I could actually survive this. Never mind, I went through the floor. Well, I'm only at nine fails, but there's supposedly 16 ways to fail. Okay, what if I blew up the playground? What would that do? Why is the bomb following me? I didn't realize the bomb could do that. I'm gonna, I'm gonna take the moose with me because I couldn't kill it with the sniper. Oh, where'd the floor go? Guys, I'm not sure what the other fails are. It does kick me off the swings when I go too fast. So maybe that counts as a fail. But yeah, I don't know. If, if you guys somehow know this, let me know in the comments. This next game is 
Poop World. Clearly, it's a very interesting game. It's got over 1.2 million visits. Outstanding reviews. I think this guy's only activity on Roblox was making Poop World, other than favoriting these games. Because he's got no items. His only friend would have been Builder Man. He got these items years later because of Poop World. He literally made it in one day and then just called it there. I gotta respect it. This, this guy knows he's created a masterpiece, apparently. Okay, here we got the weapon room with a poop stop sign. Let's see what kind of weapons we have. Bronze gun and poop flinger. Oh, okay, the poop flinger just caused an out-of-body experience. What about this thing? Okay, this thing is OP. We'll save this for later. Let's check out the clothes, 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 clothes. What's in here? Oh, I'm invisible. And this one is the poop path. <laughs> we have the candy shop. I like the watermark here. Poop candy giver. I probably don't want that. This game was definitely an experience. I see why it has 1.2 million visits. This game's called Snowboarding. Last updated in 2009. Dude, this game is so bright. I mean, I don't, I don't know what else I was expecting. It's snow. I'm sure I'll figure out a way to fix this when I'm editing the video. Let's check out the hotel. Let's... Let's check out the hotel. This door is made out of tungsten or something. That was quite the struggle. It's free to stay as long as you want. You just have to be strong enough to get the door open. And look at this, guys. I have a bed and a dresser and a gigantic box TV. There's no way this wooden table is supporting this thing. All right, well, let's go to the lift. Let me just skid through another nearly impossible door. Parachutes for skydiving. I'll, I'll grab a parachute. It's generally recommended. Step here to go up the mountain by helicopter. Okay, well, that saves me a bunch of time. <laughs> Gulp? Can I- can I push this guy down? He needs- he needs a little bit of encouragement. Do the snowboards even work? Oh- oh jeez. The snowboards do not work and I'm about to crash into a cabin. Let's try the skydiving. You know, if you had perfect timing, I think you could get on the roof of the helicopter. I'm gonna try it. Oh! This game is called Bomb Survival. Last updated in 2011. We'll see how it holds up nowadays. So far it's looking promising. It shows a map and everything. Alright, let's see if it- Okay, I'm on the map. The rules to this game is simple. Just survive from the bombs. The longer you live, the more score points you will get. The person with the most points at the end wins. Meaning that I win every time because it's just me in here. Anyway, we got five minutes on the clock. Let's try not to die here. Okay, something exploded right next to me. So this game actually does seem to work still, surprisingly. Oh no. Oh, the rocket's following me. Okay, I took a huge amount of damage, but we're still in it. Just really, I really don't want that sort of thing to happen to me right now. So I'm just kind of chilling on this side of the map. Oh, jeez. I'm having a lot of close calls right now. It looks like that's the bottom of the map down there, I think. Oh, no, another rocket. Oh, I think I'm dead. Oh, jeez. If I get down here... Okay, I'm actually still, still alive. Yeah, I think that's the strat. I'm just gonna try and block it with anything that I can, like this tree. Hopefully I don't die here. Oh, it went through the tree! Oh, jeez. Okay, somehow I outmaneuvered it once again. Guys, let me know in the comments if you guys want me to try the super version of this game. Because I, I have to imagine that's what everyone's just thinking about right now. There's satellites beaming from the sky right now. It's getting very chaotic. I'm at 900 score. There's only one minute left. If I don't survive in this last minute, I want to at least get to 1000 score. And 1000 score. Let's try and close this out. Okay, a rocket spawned right there. I'm just gonna use that as a shield. Let's see if my game gets it's ruined in these final few seconds here. It looks like it won't. Look at that. Easy win. Let's go. All right. Well, that was actually kind of fun. It seems like this game has held up quite decently over the years. Everything seems to work as it should. I don't know if the shop or anything like that works, but I'm not I'm not going to be messing with that. I'm just going to be going to the next game. Survive Tsunami Hitting a Bridge. Last updated in 2009. And apparently there's chat commands in this game. I'm not very confident that they'll work, but you never know. Anything can... Okay, there's the tsunami. It's coming in extremely fast. I don't I don't think I'm gonna go down there. Yeah, that's not... Okay, well, it actually did no damage. I mean, other than my character sliding around, it's not really... It's not really doing anything. Does this car work? Oh, the cars work. And it just flipped on its side instantly. Let me try and maneuver my way around this. Never mind, I lost my bumper. Oh, 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 jeez. I'm losing contr control of the situation. Okay, let's type bridge. I think that was one of the commands. Okay, there's the bridge. There's still giant water cubes all over it though. It's still shaking violently. Let me just, uh, just give me a second. I need to just get back up here. Well, I didn't think it was possible, but the chat commands actually do work. Let's try and survive this for real. 
Oh no. Oh, oh no. Okay. I'm, I'm about, oh, oh geez. Oh, this one's called Floater Island. Sail the seas with over 17 different boats. New locations every month. Uh, you've got a lot of catching up to do. Actually, is this guy even still? Oh, well, he's banned. Let's see what's out here. We got a sailboat, a jet ski with two entire seats, a dinghy, and a yatch. I think this is a pretty easy choice. I'm gonna take the sailboat. All right, here we go. It's making a very annoying sound right now. Almost like it has a motor on it for some reason. Kind of what I was trying to avoid. Um, what is that? I'm, I'm, I'm being chased by many different critters right now. I don't know why they're all going after me when there's people about to drown over here. I'm gonna, I'm gonna get off this thing now. I'm scared. Guess I'm taking the yatch. Why is it, why is it tipping into the water? We're doing a complete nosedive right now. We've stopped moving entirely. Um, uh, okay. Well, I guess I'm taking the jet ski. Hopefully this thing works. Okay, it's definitely gonna have the same problem. Man, the sailboat was so much faster. This is such a scam. Oh no, I'm, I'm tipping again. Whoa, oh, why is everything just going wrong right now? And now the dangerous creatures of the sea are out to get me. Oh, I just blew up. Okay. Well, I have one more option left. The dinghy. The speed bar is all messed up. Please just get me to this island. That's all I want. We're looking pretty uneven right now, I must say. And we're go- Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. Okay, somehow the boat corrected itself. Don't mind me, guys. I'm just passing through. I just want to get to this island without flying around all over the place. And as soon as I say that, we start tipping again. Okay. Okay, we're we're stabilizing. Okay, we're still nosediving into the water, but we're we're still moving towards the island. Okay, we're back at the island. Moment of truth. Am I gonna go flying? Okay, we're on. The boat is glitching out horrifically. It's trying to attack me right now. <laughs> and there it goes. It's just swimming away. All right. Well, I finally made it to Floater Island, and now I get a completely empty house. Oh no! I uh, sorry. I have a sink, and I. There's a fire out back, so I'm- Oh, nope, I got my gaming set up, we're good. And upstairs, it's just more emptiness. Everyone who tried to bring furniture over here is dead now. Oh, no, we, we've got something. This is the average male bedroom right here. This was totally worth my time, guys. Oh, we got another bedroom. Oh, and we have a fully furnished bathroom. Okay, finally something in this household. We can take a nice hot shower. Also, I, I don't know when this bulletproof vest thing appeared on my character, but I'm, I'm wearing that in the shower as well. Oh, and I have a raft home too. I'm definitely, I'm gonna be living on this for a while with my new friends. Oh, I forgot I can't do that. This next game is McBlock's Diner Grand Opening. A lot of people involved in this one. It was last updated in 2010 as well. The reviews are mostly positive, so let's check this out. They've got a big playground that's bigger than the restaurant. There's a random plant in the corner of the map outside. Oh, there's two of them. Who's taking care of all these plants? I'm a bit suspicious. Let's go inside. And I mean, it's it's just a pretty standard restaurant building, although I can't help but notice that there's seats on top of the seats. What, what What is going on here? The menu is a very stretched out image. Cheeseburger, pizza, taco, turkey. We got some drinks and dessert. We probably don't want the cheeseburger or the turkey because someone took a giant bite out of both of those. Also, it doesn't help that they were sitting there for 14 years. Anyways, let's do a turkey review. I'm not even... I'm not even eating it. I'm just looking at it. What else is there? We got some extra drinks here. We got... A bathroom here. I don't want to know what's in that garbage can, so I'm gonna walk out of here. Also, why is there a ladder here? I'm gonna go up here. Let's see. More plants. There's more plants. Just no nothing but plants in this place. Do the swings work? The swings do work. Are right, you guys ready for this? We're 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 gonna we're gonna spin around a few times and jump. Oh, I'm dead. Next up, we got Boulder Run, Stealth Training. This game separates the men from the boys. It's time to prove myself to the world by completing this decade-old Roblox game. I see the boulders. Okay, they are extremely fast. I hope this game is actually possible. All right, we've made it out of the fog. Now it's, it's time for survival. 
Okay, to the left, there we go. This is actually much easier than it looks. You have so much time to dodge them and they don't move side to side at all. Maybe this game was harder back in the day, who knows, which is the case for a lot of older games. Now I am a little concerned about reaching that part because I'm, I'm gonna be right under where they spawn. Hopefully I don't get unlucky here, that was close. We're almost there guys, I'm right under the spawn point. Okay, I just tanked that and we win. Yeah, that was, that was pretty easy. I wasn't worried at all at the end there. Actually, wait, you could probably land on the side and then just cheese the whole thing. Let me try that. I want to try this. Oh, that didn't work. Oh, geez. There we go. Now you can just cheat the whole thing because there's no boulders up here. All right, well, time for the next game. Travel through the Xbox 360. Last updated in 2008. Let's see how many spiders and cobwebs we find. Guys, it's the Xbox 360. But before we get to that part, we're gonna have to traverse this very difficult path. All right, now we're at the Xbox 360. So like, how do I get in this? All right, we're in. Jump over the cut wires. Extremely easy stuff so far. Another easy wire thing. And now, now we're walking. All right. Oh, it respawned me at the next one. Okay, we'll take that, I guess. So now do I just climb up here and win? I guess I, huh? Bro, what? Why is there an invisible kill brick thing here? Okay, what if I just jump? Nope, that doesn't help. How are you supposed to do this? Let's see what click to move thinks. Okay, click to move is no help, and I just, my body, oh wait, I got winners. That works, I guess. I'm sorry, Apple, but I'm blowing up the Xbox. Escape from School Obby, last updated in 2008. This game has 392 dislikes for some reason. It's probably just all people who want to live in their school. Good friend. Dude, the teacher is asleep. Just go home. Detention sucks. Woohoo, it's vacation. Good friend. Dude, you should get out of school and go home. It's vacation, man. The teacher actually is asleep. He just spilled his coffee all over his desk. Bully. He he he. I put it sleep powder in his cup. So the... We... We drugged the teacher. That's a little, that's a little messed up. I'm gonna get out of here before the police show up. Anyway, there's a giant hole in the roof, so I'm guessing that's where I need to go. A dude. Ah, another guy that escapes from detention. Well, it's vacation, so have fun. Dude, I just watched my friends poison my teacher, and you're telling me to have fun. Whatever, man. Aw, oh, I drilled too far in the ground, now there's lava. Dude, we're, you dug like two feet down. You don't seem concerned enough about the situation. It's even with the grass. Look, there's already, there's already two casualties. This guy is concerned about the playground as if there isn't two children that burn to death right in front of him. This, this place is severely messed up. I gotta get out of here. I assume I need to go in this tunnel. Yep. I should be submerged in lava right now. I just go in here. Nope. I'm glad we have shift lock nowadays so I can just cheat the whole thing. Should be down this way. There we go. Now how does this continue up here? Ah, there we go. See what's going on up here. Okay, we got some lava. Okay, this looks uh, a little concerning. I'm gonna have to be like perfectly lined up and everything. I'm not burned to death yet. Not sure. Why was there an explosion noise? All right, whatever. And of course I met with a bunch of zombies. Why are they walking like that? That's <laughs> The zombies are clearly under the influence of something, which is good news for me. Just gotta make my way over the french fry and there we go. Oh no. Oh, why are there trampolines here? I was doing so good, man. And then they went ahead and threw in the super broken trampolines. How many times have I made videos on old obby games only to be stopped by these trampolines? I rejoined the game to see if there's a way to just skip everything because otherwise this game's gonna be impossible. Okay, wait, this is good. I can, I can probably wrap around here. Let's see it. All right, I think I just skipped the entire obby assuming there's no hidden walls or anything. I'm just over here where I shouldn't be. Yeah, I, I won. The trampoline thing had me worried for a moment. Oh, okay. This game is called Fun in the Sun. Hello guys, I remembered that I saved this data to the hard drive on the, so I fixed it, yay. Oh yeah, this will be the oldest game we play today. It was made in 2006. Let's see what Fun in the Sun looks like. All right, here we are. So we have like a chairlift thing here. It's very wobbly. Hopefully I don't fall out of one. What's going on in this place? Is this like the bank or something? I guess this would be the vault here. It looks like someone already robbed it. Oh no, this is the vault here. Is there anything? Okay, there's nothing in this one either. 
either. So I was right the first time someone did rob this place. I guess that makes sense because this was just kind of left here for 17 years. Well, let's go to the next area. I could just walk up here, but that's no fun. I'm going to take the unsafe chairlift thing. All right, and this one just takes me to another line. I guess it was impossible to make turns back then. All right, what do we got here? We got a train. Let's see if this button works. Okay, the button works. This It's about to... Oh, we lost a wheel. Oh, jeez, this thing's lagging. I'm like, I'm teleporting all over the place here. Oh, I'm in the train. <laughs> this is so buggy. At least it's moving forward, I guess. Oh, oh no. Oh no, I'm gonna die. Oh, jeez. I need to get off this thing as soon as possible. Well, I made it to the train station alive. I guess I shouldn't be too surprised that this game mostly still works, because it's just like simple kind of physics stuff with the vehicles. I think I've had my fun in the sun. Break into the bank obstacle course. No, this bank is made in obby course form, not like a real bank would be. If you planned on using this to practice your real life bank robberies, you might want to reconsider. Open your parachute right after you jump out. Okay, I assume this is the parachute. feel like it's not supposed to look like this. All right, well, let's jump out. Wow, guys, it's the bank. You can tell it's the bank because there's $100 on the front. All right, well, let's go in. Let's rob the the bank. Oh, I was supposed to die. Okay, never mind. All right, let's jump over the lasers and keep jumping over the lasers. Pretty easy stuff so far. All right, I don't know what's going on here. Guys, I don't think this is representative of a real bank, but we are now at the next part. Somewhere there's an object you can click which gives you the code. Don't have any tools selected. Well, let's see. We got the gaming setup, which is clickable. You know, the Windows XP gaming setup. I don't, I don't think this is the code. What about the serial? So you want to know the code? Well, this box will tell you the code. Don't tell anyone else or I'll kill you. Oh, too late. It's 1200. Okay. Well, I might as well play this game like it's my last because it is my last. All right. Where are we now? Oh, did I just win? Step on this to teleport to winner's area. Well, I guess I did win. I don't see how I'm getting all of this gold out of the vault and this golden Robloxian is dead, so I don't want to mess with that. Well, let's go to the winner's area. What do we got? We got a teleport tool. I already know that's broken. What's this? Oh, I got a, I got a bunch of force fields. Just way too many force fields. I look like I'm in a snow globe right now. Unfortunately, I will have to end the video here because I told you guys the code.